First Chair is brought to you by Sun & Ski, your new mountain sports headquarters. <laughs> All right, excuse me for just a second. Let me get my hair out of the way here. So, okay, there's a lot of work that's happening here at the base of the US Open. You can hear this, this noise. It's from the snow cats that are working so hard. This is really important. This is the landing for the slope style jump. That jump that you're looking at right there, that's the last one of three jumps in the slope style course. And the athletes have a choice of either doing uh, a 60 foot jump right there or a 70 foot takeoff. So, you know, back when the Burton US Open first started Started including slope style in the contest and around 2003 uh, the the jumps at that point were around 40 or 50 feet so it's kind of amazing to see how far it's come and to know that the first jump in this in this lineup is 55 feet so they're starting at 55 feet and going up to 70 feet and you know it's gonna be an incredible competition again the ladies kick off at 11 o'clock the guys are at 2 and you can find the finals right here on TV 8 Vale also something else Right behind me, you'll, no, you'll notice this Burton pop-up shop. And if you would like to meet the Burton Olympic team, that is going to be happening today at 3.30 right here at the Burton pop-up shop. Also over at the Burton girls tent at one o'clock, you can do a ride day with some of the Burton girls. And sometimes their athletes show up. And you know who some of their athletes are? Chloe Kim and Kelly Clark and Anna Gasser. So some really incredible ladies that you could do some skiing and riding with. And it's all taking place here at the Burton US Open. All right, I have some riding to do. I'm gonna get myself ready. And we are gonna take a quick break, but coming up next, we're gonna send things back over to Mark and Tracy to find out what they are up to.